It is Saturday. What, June 10? June 10. June 9. June 9? No, 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 you're right. June 10. No, June 10. 10. So we're starting at the rear of the farmer's market. This wasn't open last time we were here. Oh, okay. They have more vegetables back here. Oh, nice. There's a restaurant called Wild Oats. From what I know about it, it's supposed to be Texas-inspired local, local grown foods. And then right over here after Wild Oats is Underbelly Burger. And that's actually owned by Chris Shepard. He's a well-known chef here in Houston. And next door to that is RC Ranch Butcher Shop. And they get their meats, I believe, from their 2,800-acre ranch. So if you're not from Houston, Underbelly is a very well-known upscale upscale restaurant yeah. it's not open yet yeah. underbelly bur burgers not open yet and then there's the egg house over here you can get like all fresh eggs and produce and stuff uh, not produce but fresh eggs and dairy so RC ranch butcher shop as I said is most of all their meats come directly from their ranch we're gonna take a quick peek Excuse us. Thank you. Hello. Yummy. Smells so good. It's all fresh meat. They have every kind of meat you want. Really? Mm hmm. Maybe lamb. Wow. They have, a, they have wagyu. Oh, wow. Nice. Wow. Nice. Yes. Adobo pork bacon. Mago beef bacon. Wow. So good. Mm -hmm. Good. And now we're almost at the front of the building already. And right in front of the RC Butcher Shop, they have these plaques on the wall that demonstrate or have the history of the airline farmer's market. 
It used to be called Canino. Uh, Canino's Farmer's Market. It was actually started because farmers did not like the conditions of where their produce was being sold. You can get fresh herbs and spices. Mole. Mole? Oh, mole. They have all different, all different types. Wow. Popular dish. I didn't realize how long this market is. Oh, no. <laughs> the big warehouse. Uh -huh. More fresh herbs. Oh, nice. Some of them I've never seen before. Or even heard of. It's actually cooler in here. It is. It's actually nice in here. They're actually somewhere. Oh, look. They have these little baby peppers. They're like little round peppers. Oh, I see. They're, they're hot. Oh. Are they? Have you tried them? Although they're very hot. We used to grow them. Oh, really? Yeah. Very, very hot. In the backyard. Mm-hmm. Fresh lychee. Fresh lychee? Yeah. And they're ripe. Oh, they're too ripe? No, they're ripe. They're perfect. Oh, good. Perfectly ripe. It's at the front. And like, so that's I love that's, Oh yeah. I know you do. <laughs> so that is just one side of the farmers market. It's not too much. Across the street is El Balio. Oh, famous bakery. But am I saying am I saying that right? El Balio, yes. And uh yeah, it's a very famous bakery. They have some of the best tres leches cakes. And Pandosas. Pandosas? Pandosas, sweet bread. Ah. Here goes a little list of all the farmers. Oh. So if you're in Houston or haven't been to Houston, it's a it's a nice little place to visit. It's a a lot of fresh produce, as we said, fresh herbs and spices. A lot of friendly people. Oh, they have lychee juice too. I should look for the the, the baby oranges that you like. 
<laughs> no more papayas right no now. Papayas. <laughs> I think the size of this is like a like a big Walmart. Yeah, a, a very big Walmart that's a straight. They have lychees too. Lychees, more lychees. Just as a side note, you may want to bring cash. So I think a lot of the vendors might be cash only. Here's crawfish and noodles. This is delicious. They have really good crawfish actually. Oh, it's so delicious. Their rice was good too, their fried rice. Oh, yes. Noodles, crawfish, everything for the fried shrimp. Fantastic. Good morning. Yeah. Hello. Hi. Oh no, we don't anymore. <laughs> you too. We have any pets or dog? We don't have a dog anymore. Well, we have cats, but yes. And it looks like today they have a. A nice little market set up in the back for, for local vendors. It's a hot day, but if you're under an umbrella, you should be okay. Yeah, underneath the, the roof, it's fine. Oh, yes, I appreciate you pulling up. And as you can see, that's about it for the farmer's market. They have a nice restaurants here. And they have a nice little market going on, at least on a Saturday. Bakery. Famous of Bolillo. Oh, they have, that's across the street. Yes. But yeah, they have their famous bakery. And uh, that's about all we're going to do for today. So don't forget to subscribe to Steady Steps. This is Eddie. Sammy. And we will see you later, I hope. Have a good one.